In nearly every religion I am aware of, there is a variation of the golden rule. And even for the non-religious, it is a tenet of people who believe in humanistic principles. In my family, we were Americans, we were Republicans, and we were Methodists. You cannot have maternal health without reproductive health. And reproductive health includes contraception and family planning and access to legal, safe abortion. Voting is the most precious right of every citizen. And we have a moral obligation to ensure the integrity of our voting process. In the Bible, it says they asked Jesus how many times you should forgive, and he said 70 times seven. Well, I want you all to know that I'm keeping a chart. Women are the largest untapped reservoir of talent in the world. You know, I think of the global economy as an inverted triangle, resting on the shoulders of the American consumer. And if the American consumer cannot have enough disposable income in order to maintain a standard of living that creates more opportunities generation after generation, that's bad for everybody. We need more good jobs that reward hard work with rising wages, dignity, and a ladder to a better life. There is a sense that things, if you keep positive and optimistic about what can be done, do work out. Human rights are women's rights, and women's rights are human rights. Remember, the IDF, the Israeli Defense Forces, have a working relationship with the Palestinian Authority Security Forces, which have been incredibly professional. I'm undaunted in my quest to amuse myself by constantly changing my hair. The need for peace in Northern Ireland goes well beyond political stability. It now speaks to regional Europe and even global stability.